So we're here at the Faith Awards, and I am standing here next to the fabulous Reverend. Is it a Reverend or Minister? Reverend. Reverend Rhonda Branch Yearby. She is the founder of this wonderful Faith Award. Can you tell me? This is just this is just wonderful. What inspired you to honor? wonderful people of God in the kingdom. What inspired me is this had been a dream of mine for about 10 years. I just got so tired of going to award show where the same people kept getting the awards all the time. And I'm sure that they all deserve them. But faith is the substance of everything about us, you know. And I wanted to honor people who are doing enormous things in the community who are ministering to people, who have good stewardship, who are helping uplift other people, not just uplifting themselves, but lifting those around them and uh, spreading globally the word of God. And that's, that's really what inspired me to do it because I've worked in nonprofits all my life. I've been a fundraiser. And, uh, and I kept noticing that a lot of people in the kingdom, you know, we have other award shows, but that's usually, again, if you're a celebrity. And the different thing about the Faith Awards, mm -hmm. I'm honoring people who may be homeless, who are rich, but they are doing extraordinary things in the kingdom of God. And that's what I wanted to do. Well, I think this is a wonderful work that you are doing, honoring God's people. I think that is so, so wonderful. How do you... How do you select the ones that you honor? Well, back in December and January, we had a nomination process. And thank God, we got a lot of nominations for you. And <laughs> That's just God's favor. And I started looking at your show and reading all about you. And I contacted you and you're like, huh? And, you know, and I wanted to highlight people just like you who are doing amazing things in the kingdom and who can empower others to have faith. You know, because if you don't have faith, you don't have anything. You have nothing without faith. And even on our wards today when I, um, they were custom made and it has the faith of a mustard seed is one of the things that's on there, but I'm gonna explain how the ward was designed and why I'm doing the faith awards. But. It was just been an honor to have met so many people who are celebrities, everyday people like me, you know, to be honored at this award. And I want to continue this every year. And I'm so excited because Harry L. Smith of the Smith Foundation it does always does events and scholarship events here at the Smith Foundation. And we were talking because he was one of the people I had never heard of. And through his generosity, offered the Smith Foundation here for the Faith Awards because he said he believed in what I was doing and wanted to make sure that I raised money for scholarships and not spend all the money on trying to get a hotel and paying caterers. So we've had some generous people. Uh, Mary Griffin, who has 21 platinum records as a country singer, who was uh, Barry Manilow was her manager. She ended up becoming a backup singer for Patti LaBelle. She's donating her time as an artist here today. We have another young man. So God has just really blessed us with this event. Uh, we have a caterer that gave us everything wholesale. So it's just a blessing. It was meant to be, and I just thank God for you being here. Oh, and I'm so happy to be here, and thank you for honoring me tonight. And I'm just, I'm just elated. I am just elated to meet wonderful people as yourself. Um, you know, God is just so good, and we give him all the praises, and we give him all the glory. Won't he do it? Yes, he will. <laughs> yes, he will do it. Continue to do it. Thank you so much for all thank of your you. help in the thank community so and for honoring so many wonderful people. Yes, thank you. Dear. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm, love you. Who else do you want?